Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and um, we have a couple of things that happened with Patch Tuesday that also went uh, into the um, under the radar, if you want. One of the first ones is that Microsoft has updated the um, Windows Defender uh, in the images of Windows. So, you know, when you download Windows uh, image, you, of course, get the image from May 2023, which is the last one that they've issued. Uh, what happens is that in there, of course, the first time you have a new fresh install, your Windows Defender or the Windows Security app is, of course, outdated for the first minutes that you're online. And so what they do is they sometimes will actually just update that portion of the image. So they're saying that they did this um, with the Patch Tuesday updates recently released so that the you know amount of outdated information from the Windows Defender or security app is as small as possible to prevent that in the first you know minutes or hours of use, you could get malware that would be undetected. Now, uh, the other thing is um, that they've actually updated also Windows security for every version of Windows, from Windows 10 to Windows 11 to Windows Server. Uh, the thing that they did, and that started with the um, version 1.395.418 and later, and of course, uh, these are all things that have uh, been changed and issued uh, a new and more perform better performance if you want a list of uh, the um, updates for the uh, malware list uh, Trojan list backdoors and so on uh, to include even more protection against them and and trying to detect them all of course like I say always that's not what you need to use you never should rely on that because it is not that great. And that is not because of Windows security. It's not that great on any antivirus. That's it. So, you know, it's it's there, but don't think that that's the protection. Protection is really what you do and you're careful. One of the things also that this has changed in the new updates, uh, starting with uh, 1.395.318, is that now the Auto KMS or the Key Management Service patching software is blocked automatically by this new version of Windows Security. So uh, this is uh, probably an information a lot of people will want to know. Um, you know, this is of course always been a war and there's a lot of problems with that, uh, especially with people trying to patch and try to, you know, key or patch the windows so that the key doesn't you don't have to you know use a product key and stuff like that problem is nine out of ten people that do that actually do it with a, a system that the patch contains malware or trojans and backdoors that you know snoop and uh, most of them always get problems over time so uh, you know and of course uh, Microsoft also does that because it just wants you to pay for Windows. But uh, all of that information, all of that update has been done since Patch Tuesday and the different versions. This is the versions that are um, for the system as of this video. But this changes quite rapidly and all the time. So if you watch this video just a few hours after this or even in a few days, you'll see that you will have updated uh, versions of all of this um, that uh, will have happened. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.